Caught up staring at those city lights Had some ugly days to get some pretty nights Cut some people off, dreams take a sacrifice Yeah, they wanna make it but can never pay the price Riding through my hometown Finally feel I'm on my shit All they talk about is us now Good morning, YouTube. My name is Benjamin Nowak, and we are out here today on the Great Lakes. And this is probably the last day of open water bass fishing that I'm going to be doing in 2017. So we are out here trying to make the most of it. It is a beautiful day. Very, very low winds, about five mile an hour winds forecasted for today. 40 degree temperatures. I'm out here without a jacket on right now. And uh, it's a nice change of pace. So we're going to do some fishing. And today is my chance to put a big seven pounder in the boat. Today is my last opportunity for this year to catch a giant, and I'm hoping to do it with Thad and Josh in the boat to help me witness it and get it in the boat and take some pictures and everything else. So stay tuned for the ride. It should be a ton of fun. First cast, last day, 2017. Maybe. Good Atta work. Boy. There. Finally. The first one of the morning. Look at how fat these fish are. Can you tell that they're feeding up for winter? It felt so good. Does a fat kid like cake? Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's exactly what this is. <laughs> this lure is smallmouth candy. Looks like a goby, minnow, whatever. So these fish are feeding up on oh and these fish just love it they just love that little lure because that's what they're getting Different fat colors. on that's a light, light color. pretty fish you can tell they're feeding on bottom too just by looking at their belly i mean look at all the scales that he's kind of rubbing raw on himself they're all straight on the belly oh it feels good to get that first fish in the boat i will tell you what First fish on one of our last days of the year. Not necessarily the size we want, but it's a good way to start. We're kind of figuring it out where these fish are. And uh, hopefully that'll give us a key we need to get on some more of these big smallmouth. Hopefully put a seven in the boat today. Huh? Here, when do you have, no, 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 let it go back down. When you get snagged, that means that there's a big rock there. Just let it, feel? Yeah. That's a fish. Right off that. Good work. There you go, buddy. Put one in the boat. Yes, on the blade bait. First one on the blade? Yeah. Just went heavy. Couldn't even tell. I just started reeling. There. That's big. That's real big. Unless I'm hung. I thought it was a fish, but I'm hung. Oh, come on. 
I thought that's what we do to each other. We hang up and we pretend it's a fish. I want to know how I taught myself how to fish deep. Just imagine fishing deep as being as long as this boat. That's how deep we're fishing. That's 20 feet deep. It's not really that far. No, it's actually starting to fight. Better. I think it's a decent one. That's a dandy. Oh, that's a nice one. Damn, okay. Hey! Yeah, pal. Good work, man. Oh. Good work, buddy. Oh, there's another one. Two on a board for that. He ain't getting skunked today, boys. That is a fish. He catches all the fish. <laughs> that's a good one. Oh, that's a dandy. <laughs> hey! <laughs> that's a four. That's a big one. That's a PB. I got one. Get your fish out of the net. Oh no, mine came off. <laughs> <laughs> what about me? I got my stuff in the water. Calm down, big boy. Calm down. That's Just a big one. Silver. <laughs> what do I got? Gold. I love gold. Just today. Silver. Okay, for real, though. Get your fish out of there. <laughs> this is a big one, dude. I got you, buddy. You coming. Doubled up. There's damn hooks in the net. Here. Oh shit. Just, just let me see. Just give me some. Hey! Oh, baby. Chinese fire drill. Doubles. Mine's not as big, but still a beautiful. I'll go back to the back of the Small mouth. Here we go. Here we go. I'll go to the back of the bag. Doubled up. Doubled up, boys. We're doubled up now. On the blades. This one's got to go back, boys. But look at that. We done did a double. Double take. Double take. All they talk about is us now. Never thought we'd get it like this. Along my way, I'm a so many mistakes. Took a little time to be away. Oh, we got a zebra! Look at this zebra we caught. That's a cool looking fish. This is actually... It has to do with their pigmentation. So it's like, um, when people have like skin spots or something, that's what happens to bass. There's a chemical in them, and I can't think of the name, but essentially, it causes them to get black spots on them. It's nothing wrong with this fish. It's super healthy, beautiful fish, but it just has black spots. Fancy spots. Look at that zebra. Huh. That is awesome. That is super, super cool. You hardly ever catch any like this out here on Lake Huron. So this is a really rare, amazing fish to catch. And on the very last trip of 2017. Sweet. We're being attacked by the fog. Fog bank. Look at the school of fish right here. Oh, yep, I see it. Yep. Right yeah. there. Just about. Maybe a little right, but that's insane. That's why I love panoptics, man. It's like, it takes the guesswork away. There's one. What is that? What is that? A giant walleye? No, that's a lake or something. What? Is it a, I didn't see it. It's like a laker. <laughs> or like a trout. <laughs> Dude! What the heck? There's a whole bunch right below the boat if someone wants to drop and catch another one. Hey! What is this thing? 
Is that a laker? Is that Yo, a lake trout. Dude! Hey! Big old lake trout. What? How crazy is that, guys? That's a first. I thought it was That's a, a first and was, a PB. I thought that was a giant walleye. I had no idea what that was. Want to grab me the pliers and someone grab the camera when you get a sec? Yeah. And someone how, uh, would like to teach me how to hold one? Same. Check out this lake trout that I caught on one of those blades. That is insane. We've caught some really rare fish today. That zebra smallie and then this laker. <laughs> it is insane. The last day of the year and we've caught some insane fish. Check this out. We're gonna let this thing go. <sighs> Swim free, little buddy. Kicked away. <laughs> so cool. Gosh, good work. That's so cool, guys. Midday update for you guys. Gonna have a quick sandwich, but I'll talk to you about the baits that we're throwing. This is a half and a 5 8 ounce blade bait. That's what we've been throwing all day to catch these fish. That's the silver color that's been catching them mainly. Um, and I'm throwing it on a seven foot one arc invoker rod. It's a medium extra fast. And that extra fast tip, if you guys have watched my videos, is what I like to throw blade bait on because you can feel those bites really, really well. But we're gonna keep moving around. We have been surrounded by fog absolutely everywhere. Almost run over by a boat. Caught a lake trout, caught a zebra bass. Basically had a pretty insane day already, but we're gonna keep fishing. You never know. We need to catch a new PB, catch a seven pounder and break that seven pound goal for 2017. So only way we're gonna make that happen is if we keep fishing. We're gonna eat the sandwich really quick and get back at it. Oh boys and girls. For the last day of the year, this has been pretty uh, um, pretty amazing. Catching numbers, catching big ones, having a couple laughs. Doesn't get a whole lot better. Coming up, coming up, coming up. That's a good one. God, I swear to God. <laughs> Bam! Ooh, fat cat right there. Look fat at how he choked that. I fat cat. I swear to God, dude. Pepper. That's a 512. Pepper. Oh my God. That is a chunk. Woo! He choked your blade. <laughs> dude. That's a big fish. That's That makes up for it all right there. 5-1. Hey! Dude, that's a big one. That's a giant. Uh, that counts as three. No, we're going to count him as one. But, you know, he's the biggest one. That's the he's big like, we'll one. Okay. one. He's the biggest yeah, one. Yeah, baby. We'll count that as one, but just Woo! keep it in your mind. As long as he's the big one. He's got a hell of a battle scar. He's a battle warrior. That's why. Yeah, you guys can't appreciate how foggy it is, but there's like... It doesn't seem like it until you like look around. Yeah, you can't see anything. That's a good one. That's a really good one. Yes! Whoa! That's a juicy one. Oh, he came off. Oh no, he didn't. He just barely had that. Oh, oh, oh. Hand me those flyers real quick. Well, you guys didn't get to see any of that because my camera had just shut off. But, but. Giant. Small ball. That was awesome. That was awesome. We're gonna get us get a weight on this bad Jesse. Zeros. Yeah. Four pounds, nine ounces. A real solid, big old small mouth. Okay, folks at home, I'm gonna pitch this out to a boulder and it'll be my last cast, likely of 2017. Hey, I'm 
done. I'm good. That's how we're gonna end it for me too. That is all that she wrote. That is gonna be it for the 2017 bass fishing season. Soft water, that is. But it was an amazing day with these two guys, Thad, Pioneer Outdoors, and Josh Tanner. Uh, we had a blast, we caught a ton of fish, and we caught a lot of rare fish. And when I say rare, I'm saying rare for this body of water and rare for me. First lake trout I've ever caught, and we caught that spotted zebra smallmouth that I've never seen on Lake Huron. So it was a, an amazing day, had a ton of fun. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel so that way you guys can watch more big smallmouth catching videos. You get a bunch of tips and tricks as well as a bunch of different videos as the year goes on. So thank you guys for watching. Take care, tight lines. God bless. Pursue your passion.